Yo, 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 what is good, YouTube? It is your boy, Make America Lit, back with another NBA 2K22 video. And this video is actually a banger, bro. I ain't even gonna hold you, bro, because today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys basically the fastest way. Like, I mean, literally, I put out another method, like, maybe a week or two ago on how to get fast playmaking, but this right here is the fastest method by any means or whatever, at least for me. You know, this was the fastest way I could get, uh, my playmaking badges so um and, and you're gonna get your shooting or your finishing whatever whatever it is that you need you're gonna be getting those badges as well but then afterwards you're gonna be getting your playmaking badges as well too so you're gonna be knocking out two birds with one stone you know what i'm saying but this is primarily gonna really really help you get your playmaking i mean i guess if you run a pick and roll it can help you get your finishing or shooting and stuff like that too but i primarily use it for playmaking since I don't know. I feel like playmaking is harder to get in career, bro. Like, you pass the ball, and they always make an extra pass. They don't want to go up with it. They be bricking unless you have, like, bronze dimer or some shit, man. I, I don't get it, man. But anyway, um, in order to do this method, though, you will need, like, a 70 to 75 team chemistry. I'm not sure if it's 70 or 75. I know last year was 70. It might be a 75 team, chem team chemistry this year. So just to be on the safe side, Get your um get your team chemistry up to a 75. The way to do that is to just play good defense and be a good teammate. You know what I mean? Play defense, uh, get assists, pass the ball to your teammate. Don't call and mash X or A to call for the ball excessively because every time you do that, you know your teammate grade don't go uh your teammate grade go down. Don't leave your assignment because your teammate goes down. And try not to let your man score because defensive breakdown does bring down the team chemistry as well too. And after games, just make sure that you answer, you know, just, just give the, uh, you know, the general response that everybody, you know, gives in the NBA. The whole, nah, it's my team or my coaches. Don't be cocky. And your team chemistry will go up very fast and you will unlock team takeover. Now, as you can see, you know, in this clip, I'm going to play the clip and let y'all see. I got team takeover, which means I can control everybody. And when you can control everybody, you can basically choose who scores. You know what I'm saying? So, bam. I, I actually team takeover, bam. I get the ball, pass it to Clay. I can force him to shoot because I'm controlling everybody. So, there's no more 90 pump fakes that they do when you pass them the ball. There's no more, oh, they don't go up with it or they pass the ball to somebody else. And you can play better defense, too. Look, so on fast breaks, I'm just running it down and I'm just throwing it to whoever. Just like I'm playing a normal game of 2K. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I would have passed it to him without team takeover, Sometimes they go up with it. Sometimes they'll make an extra pass. Because, like, you are playing on the Warriors. You know, he might have seen Steph Curry on the wing or something. Uh, and they might have passed it. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, right now, I'm just playing the passing lanes because I'm trying to see if I can get the steal or whatever. I can get the ball back faster. Because right now, they're just wasting my team takeover, you know? And the AI, I was about to say AI getting cooked, but I guess not. And, yeah, man, you just throw it down to whoever. Look at that. I've, I've already gotten two assists within like 40 seconds man like this is literally one of the fastest methods to get in your uh playmaking look he gets a steal i'm throwing it him bam throwing it to him another assist bro this is the fastest method and then what you're gonna do right is once your takeover runs out and you're not controlling anybody but yourself anymore just get whatever badges you need so you see i'm trying to just leave him open so you just shoot that shit but he won't even shoot that shit he's passing now i ain't about to let him just lay me like that but he's still lay me you know what i'm saying what it is but i'm just trying to hurry up and get as many assists as possible as quickly as possible before the takeover runs out you know what i'm saying so bam run a little pick and roll wisely and i'm telling you look i went from like what six assists or, or five assists to nine assists already and it's only been like maybe a minute if even that this is hands down the fastest method bro to get your play playmaking badges or whatever and then like i said once your take once your team takeover one runs out once this runs out or whatever all I'm going to do is get my shooting, 
I'm gonna either get my shooting or I'm gonna get my, uh, you know, finishing badges or whatever like that. And then once I filled up team takeover again, more assists. So look at that. I'm now at 10 assists already. And I still have a little bit of team takeover left. So if I could get like, you know, one skill real quick, which I didn't, I got a reach in five. If I could have got one one skill real quick, you know what I'm saying? I probably could have got like one more assist. So I'm, I'm gonna just run this back really quickly. To show you that I started with four assists. I start, as you can see, the clip started me with four assists when I had team takeover. And at the end, I had 10 assists in like a minute. Maybe a minute and 30 seconds, man. So this this right here is the fastest method. I believe I have another clip of showing me with team takeover and how quickly it is. As you can see, I got 41 points. I missed the layup with Draymond. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I hit the free throws or whatever. And then we, we right back to it, man. Right back to it. And this is this is gonna get you just easy, easy assist, man. Like you don't have to throw lobs if you don't want to throw lobs. You don't have to put special delivery on or any of that other bullshit that people are telling you you have to do. Look at that shit. Throw it down to Curry, yo. Just pull that shit in his face. He got he got 99-3 and he got sharp takeover, bro. Like come on now. You you don't really have to do anything. The best part about me being on the Warriors is that pretty much everybody can shoot and everybody has sharp take, man. So it's like. I think the only person that don't have sharp take is um, Draymond. Draymond don't have sharp take, and I think Andrew Wiggins has slash and take, or a shot creating take. He doesn't have sharp take. But most of the people on uh, Curry, Thompson, Wiseman, um, Jordan Poole, most of these dudes have sharp take, man. So it's even easier. You know what I'm saying?